Notre Dame College in Ohio has announced that it will close at the end of the spring 2020 for semester. The decision comes as the college faces challenges related to declining enrollment, a shrinking pool of traditional age students, rising costs, and significant debt. From 2014 to 2022, total fall enrollment at Notre Dame declined nearly 37, from 2,281 students to 1, for for 4, according to federal data. Officials from the Roman Catholic College had explored options to remain open, including fundraising, refinancing debt, and accessing federal and state pandemic relief. However, these efforts were not enough to close budget gaps and fulfill debt obligations. The college had also met with administrators at Cleveland State University in recent months to explore a merger or acquisition, but these discussions were unsuccessful. In response to the closure, Notre Dame College has arranged for students to continue their studies through teach-out agreements with 10 other institutions. These include Baldwin Wallace University, Case Western Reserve University, Cleveland State University, Hiram College, John Carroll University, Kent State University, Lake Erie College, Ursuline College, and Walsh University in Ohio, as well as Mercerhurst University in Pennsylvania. According to an FAQ, students transferring to partner institutions can expect to pay the same net tuition costs and graduate on time. The college is still negotiating teach-out agreements with additional institutions. The closure of Notre Dame College adds to a growing number of college closures and consolidations in recent years, with at least four public and nonprofit colleges in Ohio closing since 2018 and 20 institutions announcing closures or consolidations in 2023.